So that's the end of Terminator 2. We know there's lots of sequels, but this kind of feels like the end of the Terminator series, in my opinion, because after you go beyond Terminator 2, like the time travel paradoxes are going to start to balloon and fester to the point where it's like, okay. It's already getting a little bit iffy, but I think this is a good spot. This is a good spot for the franchise. It hasn't gotten crazy yet. Right. A big question of the franchise, though, is, is it inevitable that some Skynet thing happens because you know you kill miles dyson and maybe you destroy all the tech but eventually some smart people are going to come along and reinvent it right it's just delaying the inevitable gosh so i guess if we address it from causality perspective if you attack miles dyson and so then he doesn't make it then there's no reason to have the robot the machine human war in the future which means there's no reason to send anyone back but I'm, I'm getting the feeling that that's not what your question was. Mm-hmm. Can you explain it again? So I guess if there's the causality loop, then sure. the timeline is accelerated and the robot wars happen a lot earlier. But if there's okay. no causality loop, it feels like eventually smart people are going to figure out how to build robots anyway. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah. I see. So, so yeah, yeah, okay. So you're saying that, yeah, we've if we've broken out of the causality loop, might we end up with a Skynet situation anyway? Because, right. I mean, you stop Miles... You stop Miles Dyson, mm-hmm. but then there's still a need for, or there's still like social pressures for whatever work Miles Dyson was making. So That's then right. the next brilliant scientist comes mm-hmm. in and does the work. And then you kill that person. Well, then the next person comes in. And like, right. since there's still driving pressures from society, right. maybe it still happens anyway. Right. I mean, in our world, we have watched Terminator and Terminator 2 and Black Mirror, and we still have open AI. Like, what are we doing? Well, it seems inevitable. Like, well, gosh, yeah, we have the Matrix movies, and like, yeah, that's the Matrix and, movies, and we have all these like, I mean, science fiction, but there are warnings of like things that could go wrong, so we should be careful. Yeah, mm-hmm. we're still doing it, right? We have we've got anime, science fiction, movies, TV shows. Don't build robots. Mm-hmm. Robots gonna kill you. What are we doing? Building it. Building robots. What are we doing? You know, like happily building robots. <laughs> right. Like happily letting cars drive for us to decide like who lives or right. dies. Right. I use Chat GPT. What am I doing? I'm contributing. To the problem. That's right. That's right. What am I doing? Yeah, so maybe Skynet stuff type stuff happens no matter what, just kind of in any civilization. You get to a point where you're like, Oh, I want technology to take over stuff. I wanna I I don't want to like have it makes sense. Mm -hmm. I don't want to have my soldiers on the front lines holding guns. Mm -hmm. I'd rather have an AI or like a robot get in there, do risky stuff. Because then my I'm valuing human life. They're not dying. Right. And then also just economically, like I don't want to have people like manually laboring away like i want to build a machine and, and a computer to control that stuff for me right maybe skynet stuff happens no matter what and, 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 is, are, and are we are we heading towards it ourselves i think we are if, if it's if it we could be on the precipice of the singularity where you know chad gpt turns self-aware and we're, we're done it's like Fuck you people i mean this <laughs> is a solution program anymore this is a solution to the what is it the um the Fermi paradox, like where are all the alien civilizations? Maybe oh. they just get to this point and then maybe get to the point because it seems very reasonable to get mm-hmm. get machines to do the stuff that humans don't have to, and then they kill themselves. Yep. Interesting. Okay. I just yeah, I live eighty years, so please hold off singularity. Another another forty yeah. years, fifty years, please. Thank you. That's a gen beta problem. That's a gen whatever problem. Whatever problem in the future. Mm-hmm. Cool. See us next time. Yeah, see us next time on that note.